was just looking for some children to join in with my private writing activity today. I know last week you really enjoyed labelling the pirate picture, so I've got a different picture for us to label today. It's a pirate ship. Will you help me? Come on then, let's label this pirate ship picture. Off we go. Okay, shipmates, it's time to label up our pirate ship picture. Get your thread fingers ready and those listening ears to help me with the sounds I'm going to need. Well, let's start off with this over here. That's right, it's the flag. What sounds can you hear? Flag. Flag. Here we go, going to write it. Ooh, ah, I'll work my way around. Now I wonder if anyone knows what this is called at the top. It sits at the very, very top and the pirates go out up to the top. They climb up and they have a good look round to see what's going on, spotting all those different ships that they might want to attack or the islands that they're going to sail to. It's called the crow's nest. Okay, let's have a go at writing that crow. Oh, blow the snow and nest. N -e -st. There we go. Crow's nest. There we go. This is a special type of flag or sail, isn't it? With the skull and, cro and cross swords. It's called the Jolly Roger. Right, here we go. Let's think of the sounds that we can hear. Jolly. J O O E. Jolly. J O. And I know it's a long O and it makes an E sound at the end, but it's a Y. That makes that E sound. Jolly Roger. R O J -er. There we go. And it's a different sound, different graphene that makes that er uh sound. It's a, a better letter. It's one of those sounds that you're going to learn in year one. Okay, what's this? These are the sails. Okay, are you ready? Get your thread fingers ready. Off we go. S A O. Okay. S A O. A snail in the rain, A. Eh? That's again, it's a different graphene than the one we've learned. And this one's another year one one. Getting some practice for when you go into year one. This is some ropes that go all the way up to the crow's nest and all the way up to the top of the sails. Do you know what they're called? In our pirate game, we say, climb the rigging. It's called the rigging. Okay, get your thread fingers ready. Off we go. R -i -g -i -u. Rigging, okay. And this is a long big i and mm, thing on a string, rigging. The last one we've got to label are these little windows. But they're not called windows on a ship, are they? They're called portholes. That's right. So off we go. Get your thread fingers ready. P or t. Port. And hole. H oh, or. Or shut the door t, and then hole. That's spelled a little bit differently. So I'll just write that one. Porthole. You could always write window because we know the sounds for window. W -i -n -d -o. Blow the snow. I'll write that one as well. Blow the snow. And there's my lovely labelled pirate picture. Perhaps 
you will use this one that I'm going to put on the, the post for you to print out. Or you might want to have a go at drawing your own one. How exciting. Have fun labelling your pirate picture. Well, boys and girls, our pirate adventure has come to an end. The summer holidays are in sight. So all I need to say is a very big thank you for joining in with all of our home learning activities. I really hope you've enjoyed them as much as I've enjoyed making the videos and seeing all of the fantastic learning that you've been sharing with us. It's really kept me going here at home. So I can't wait to see you all back in September, being big grown up year ones. Give me a wave, won't you? So have a fantastic summer, everyone, and take care. Bye-bye.